Hi friends, welcome back to Team Education. Friends, in this video, we are uh, solving problem on orthogonal trajectory. Okay, given problem is find the orthogonal trajectories of the curve A is equal to R square cos theta, where A is a parameter. Okay friends, now given function you consider as equation number 1. This function is in terms of R and theta. First, we have to consider the given function as equation number 1. Later, we have to differentiate equation 1 with respect to theta. And uh, we have to eliminate the parameters or any arbitrary constant. Then we will get the differential equation of 1. That is, you have to consider as equation number 2. Okay. Later, we have to find the orthogonal trajectory. For that, we have to replace dr by d theta is equal to minus r square into d theta by dr. If you have simplified this, then you will get a, again one differential equation if you are uh, using variable separable method or any other first order, uh, first degree differential equation method, we will get the function in terms of r comma theta. This function is uh, equation number 3 is called required orthogonal trajectory of the given function. Okay friends, now coming to the problem, here you observe friends, given problem is, I am considering as the equation number 1, that is a is equal to r square into cos theta, equation number 1. Now taking log on both sides, log on both sides, if I take in log on both sides, then I will have log a is equal to log r square, log a into b, what is the formula we have log a b? log a plus log b okay then log a plus here this is considered as a this is considered as a b then log a plus log cos theta okay now this is log a power m so apply again log formula then you can write n log a type m log a okay now 2 into log r plus log of cos theta okay friends which value this is log a value consider this as equation number now you differentiate this equation to okay differentiate equation to with respect to what variable theta okay friends if i differentiated this one with respect to theta log a is a constant means independent term so this derivative will be 0 which is equal to 2 into log r derivative is 1 by r into dr by d theta plus log of bracket derivative 1 by bracket what is the bracket here you have cos theta so 1 by cos theta into cos theta derivative with respect to theta is what we have minus sin theta okay friends now you simplify this then we will have 2 by r dr by d theta minus cos theta by sorry sin theta by cos theta is tan theta is equal to 0 consider this as equation number 3 this equation is called differential equation of 1 differential equation of the one. But what we required? Orthogonal trajectory we required. So, to find the orthogonal trajectory. Okay. For that, what we have to do? We have to replace dr by d theta by minus r square into d theta by dr. Okay, friends. Now, 2 by r into, what is the dr by d theta we are replacing? Minus r square into d theta by dr. Okay, friends. Now, minus r square into d theta by dr minus tan theta is equal to 0. Okay, friends. Now, denominator r and numerator are getting cancelled. Now, this is minus 2r into d theta by dr minus tan theta is equal to 0. Is a first order and first degree differential equation. So, I am applying variable separable method. When we are applying the variable separable method, the d theta and the dr should be in the numerator. But dt, d theta coefficient should be theta. dr coefficient should be function of r. Okay, d theta coefficient should be a function of theta. dr coefficient is also function of r, but not in that order. So, what I am doing? I am taking tan theta left side. Means uh, divide with the tan theta, divide with 2r. Anyhow, I will do one more step for you. This is a uh, d theta minus tan theta into dr is equal to 0. Now, cross multiply, then you will have minus 2 times of, 1 by tan will become what? Cot theta d theta minus, this r will goes to 
right side divide with r means 1 by r here this will be 0 okay 1 by r dr 0 by r is 0 0 by tan theta, is, tan theta is also 0 now integrating on both sides then minus 2 integral of cot theta d theta minus integral of 1 by r dr is equal to integral of 0 okay friends now minus 2 is a minus 2 what is the cot theta integration cot is nothing but what cot is nothing but cos theta by sin theta yes or no actually integrand is not containing both the numerator and denominator what is the denominator derivative that is in the numerator sin theta derivative is in numerator cos theta so we use the formula log of f dash of x by f of x dx is log of f of x formula okay now log of sin theta so this is minus log of sin theta minus denominator r numerator uh, denominator derivative in the numerator so log r is equal to log c so minus c i can take common uh, it will be goes to outside this minus log c will become plus log c because this log c is an arbitrary constant now this two log sin theta i can write as a log of sin square theta plus log r which is equal to log c friends you observe this is log a plus log b form so can i write this as a log a b nothing but sin square theta into r is equal to log c taking anti log on both sides if i take an anti log on both sides then i will get a sin square theta into r which is equal to c where c is any arbitrary constant so for the given function a is equal to r square into sin theta the orthogonal trajectory is c is equal to c r b whatever it may be friends okay sin square theta into r is it clear friends right similarly we are going to solve another problems also in the next video thank you for watching this video